Hey guys, in the this side from 24 by 7 everything. Hope you all are doing great. We are again back with another video and this time it's on Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 related to its latest version for the Android 10 Beta 5 with the version 438. So let's begin with that. So in this particular video we'll see how to download and install the Android 10 Beta 5 for, with the version 438. So at this moment I am not sure whether this will, this will be state, stable or beta. Most probably I would say 90 out of 100 or I would say 90% chances that this is considered to be as a beta 5 version and even there is no update mentioned on their official website I would say ASUS official website so if there will be any change then I will be reviewing that part or I will be mentioning that part in the coming videos or maybe in the review video so before we proceed with the download and installation part let me proceed let me confirm you a few things that at present uh, the installed version is 060 uh, with the security patch level of December 2019 and with the latest 438 Android 10 Beta 5 we will be moving to the December 2020 security patch. Now we the main important part is that how we can download and install that particular update. So for that I have already created or I would say drafted an article on my official blog. The URL for the same will be provided to you in the description box below so that you can go over afterward. Let me open the Chrome browser. So this is the article that I will be sharing with you in the description box below so that you can go over afterwards. So nothing major has been mentioned here. A few minor things like this is a build number. Basically this is a full firmware update which is approximately 1.67 GB approximately. Uh, and this will surely be going to update your phone or upgrade your phone to Android 10 Beta 5 with the version 438. Now before we proceed with the downloading process and installation process, there are a few important notes that needs to be considered. So first one is for the Android Pie user. So if you are an Android Pie user, you should be at least on version 060, 61, 63, 82, 84 or the very latest Android Pie version that is 087 uh, before you can upgrade to this particular Android 10 Beta 5. And on the other hand, if you are already on Android 10 Beta versions, so you should be at least on version 407, 424, 429 or 432. So all the four versions are compatible with this particular Android 10 Beta 5. And apart to this, there is a very important note. I would say it will be really best that if you can take a backup before doing any downloading and installation process because uh, at this, at my side, I haven't faced any issue, but there are a few instances in the past where users have complained that brother, I am asking, I have been asking for the uh, password to be entered during the boot process. How can we get rid in that particular case? You can only uh, get rid by doing the hard reset using stock recovery. So I would really recommend to take backup of your internal storage because afterward it will not be recoverable and we can't do anything in that. Now the very important part that from where we will be going to download. So this is a link which is coming from the official ASUS website. So you just have to tap it here and it will download in your download folder and afterward you just have to move to the internal storage. So to cut down the time I have already downloaded the file and it's in my download folder afterward you just select this either copy to or move to the internet story that I've already done. Let me show you that as well. And this is that particular file. So once you'll be putting here, you just need to restart phone. But before doing that, I need to confirm few things with you. Like firstly, the status of camera to API phone version 060 is legacy and most probably it, it will be going to update to level three, but we'll verify. Apart to this DRM info or guideline certification at my side, it is L3 and if it is L1 at your side, then for sure it will be L1 once you will be upgrading to Android 10 Beta 5. So let's restart the phone and afterward we'll move to the installation process or upgradation process. In the meantime, our phone will be restarted or rebooted to the home screen or login screen. I will also be create, going to create downgrading process related video as well and I will be posting this in coming one or two days. If you will be facing any major issue after installing this then you can uh, downgrade to the desired versions according to your likings and, and so. So finally we have been booted to the login screen or home screen so let me just tap it here. Now you will see one prompt like system update file detected just tap it here and it will show you entries. At, at this moment I am having this file in three space, uh, three uh, folder. One is on internal storage, root folder, then in, uh, download folder in internal storage, and afterward, the third one is in my SD card. So by default, it is showing me two from the root directory from the internal storage and SD card. So I'm going to select the one which has been by default selected by OS. 
so i'm just going to tap it here and it will take nearly about 5 to 10 seconds or at most 15 seconds to prepare the update and restart our phone so let's wait till the time phone will be restarted so finally our phone has been restarted now it will move to the system install wizard option or screen and afterward it will take nearly about 5 to 7 minutes or at most 10 minutes so you just have to keep a have like some patience so do not play with your volume rocker buttons or power buttons so finally the installation system wizard has invoked the install system update process so once it will be confirmed then we'll verify a few other things as well so finally the installation process has been completed and it has just invoked the restart process and afterward within next two to three minutes it will be booted to the login screen or i would say home screen and afterward we'll do the verification process so finally the phone has been restarted successfully and booted to the login screen or home screen and you, you can also see this particular prompt where finishing system update and afterward we got the successful system update prompt as well so just tap on ok and in the meantime this will complete in the background let's move to the about section and verify that we have successfully upgraded to the version 438 so you can view 438 Android 10 with the security patch level 5 December 2020. Now before we wrap up the video we need to verify two other things as well that we have done before starting the upgradation process. One is camera to API. So with this particular part we got level 3 support which is very nice. And a part of this with this particular DRM info wide one certification at my side it will be again showing me L3 but if it was L1 at your side then most probably it will be L1 with this particular, I would say, upgrade as well. And a part of this, as I've already mentioned you, that I'll be creating a downgrading process uh, related video as well and so on. So stay tuned till then. This was all from my side related to this particular video where we have downloaded and installed the latest Android 10 Beta 5 version with the version number 438. Hope you like this video. If you really like this video, kindly share this with your friends and family. And a part to this, please subscribe to our channel because this will surely motivate us and boost us to create more videos like this in the coming future. Finally, it's the time to sign off now. Bye for now. Thanks.